it's a, a certainly unprecedented in recent history anyway to get two teams, both World Cup finalists, uh, here, uh, you know, to play to the public. It's, it's quite a dream, actually. Now, um, speaking of exciting news, you've got Winston Reid who's just signed with uh, West Ham. Are you anticipating more signings like that? Have you got, heard of anything? I haven't heard of anything, no. But, uh, you know, uh, I noticed Tommy Smith playing at the weekend and scored a goal for Ipswich. So uh, hopefully Ipswich will go up to the Premier League as well. I mean, I think there's, you know, there's options for, for, for more players to be in the Premier League. But, uh, no, I don't know of any. Did the West Ham people sort of have a chat to you and say, like, they'll look at you in the ball? No. But, uh, I believe that Aaron Grant talked to Ricky, uh, which would be the right person to talk to, uh, and, uh, and, and that Ricky gave him very positive feedback. And I'm sure that they would have reviewed the uh, DVDs of the World Cup performances, uh, where I think Winston was just colossal. Um, now, who, who's going to coach the All Whites? Uh, Ricky, Ricky Herbert will definitely be coaching the All White. We're just a uh, case of uh, completing the paperwork, but uh, no, we've uh, done a handshake agreement, and that handshake will be uh, is being put into words as we speak. So, so that's something he's going to sign on the dotted line very soon, and uh, how long for? Yeah, it, it'll be. Look, that's all being worked through. All, you know, literally all the. You know, as, as with any employment contract, there'll be a, 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 there'll be probably fifteen pages, and it'll take uh, either fifteen minutes or fifteen days to work through those fifteen pages. But uh, uh, his employment contract will will be finalised. Yeah. Well, I'm certainly hopeful within the next two to three weeks. Uh, now, how did you manage to, to get Honduras? Well, we've, uh, through a match agent, actually, uh, which is often the way it's done, uh, we'd put out feelers with a number of countries for quite a long time, and uh, and had, had you get expressions of interest, and then they either go away or, or, or increase as you keep going. Uh, then, then it gets to a point where you start negotiating on numbers, and, and it kind of goes backwards and forwards, I guess, like bringing any any uh, star act to, to the country. But, um, you know, we were really grateful when we got Paraguay across the line, and that was done with the Australian uh, FF. So we worked closely with them, uh, and then we went right. Let's see what else we can get. And we'd been in discussion with uh, an agent vis-a-vis uh, uh, -vis, uh, Honduras, and uh, so we were able to bring that across the line as well. So, as I say, a real win-win. I don't mean to rain on your parade, but shouldn't we be playing Spain? I mean, they're the only other unbeaten team in the World Cup. Love to play Spain, but um, yeah, unfortunately, just I think they were engaged. We couldn't quite get through to them. So what? You sent the email out in Spanish, and you thought, oh. Try some other Spanish-speaking countries. Well, I think they fought it on. <laughs> yeah, no, no, I can't understand it, but no, I actually uh, couldn't quite get Spain across the line. But you know, we've got Spanish speakers, so we've made a good start. You're getting there. <laughs> yeah, yeah exactly, exactly, Baby steps. exactly. Who else was on the list anyway? Uh, we were we'd, we'd targeted actually pretty wide. I mean, we had a list where we started off with about uh, I think we approached about 15 countries plus. Um, but we always felt that uh, South slash Central America was a, a arguably an easier place to to get teams to come down here from, and and, and that's proven to be true. So um, you know, it's it, it's not quite the uh, the flight that it is, I guess, from Europe. Having said that, with both uh, Honduras and Paraguay, uh, you know, they've got a large number of players that play in Europe who have to fly here from there anyway. So.